besties so what I'm going to be doing today is a baby bottle pop label um, so I'm going to be doing this in Cricut and um, I will go ahead and print and cut it as well so what I'm going to start off with of course is the measurements for you guys and then I'll just quickly put this together and then um, we can go ahead and assemble it so the measurements that I used is 5.25 by 1.35 okay uh, this is going to be a pretty simple video um, because it's really not going to be much to designing this. Just make sure that when you are putting together your label that you leave some space on one side for either tape or just overlap. You want to have that space on the side. So I am pretty much going to be using the same stuff that I did in my uh, rip roll wrapper. The font is Zude. It's a Cricut Access font. I'm using the same barcode that I pretty much always use. It is available in my Facebook group in the files. So like that uh, the the clip art I just got from Google, and the background I got from Creative Fabrica, which is um kind of like an Etsy, um, but they have tons of files. So I do have their uh, subscription. And um, so it pretty much lets you download most things or pretty much everything on their site for a monthly subscription. Otherwise, I'm pretty much done with this. It wasn't really much to it. So I'm going to go ahead and flatten this and go to make it. I'm going to see how many you can get on one page. like you can get around six on one page which is pretty good and I will go ahead and send a printer I'm gonna print this on my HP Envy go to advanced options uh, the setting will be plain paper and I always print print at the best quality I'm gonna go ahead and print Okay guys, so what I did was I accidentally, uh, I didn't change my paper to the sticker paper. So I ended up printing on copy paper and then I went back and printed on sticker paper. So I'm gonna show you how both look. Um, this is sticker paper. So this is how looks although I did that wrong okay so that is how it looks with the sticker paper and then this is the copy paper so what I'm gonna do is just tape down a line on the actual bottle okay So this is how they came out. These two right here are actually done in sticker paper. And as you can see here at the bottom, it does have like some ruffling on the sticker paper. Um, just because it is a curved bottle at the bottom and it's trying to basically adhere to it. So these two um, on this side are actually copy paper. So I want to say I prefer this method just because I feel like, you know, it won't have that same look like this. Um, so either copy paper or glossy paper either would probably work but this is how they came out if you guys have any questions regarding this video please let me know down below in the comments i thank you as always for watching and i'll see you on the next video